What up, babies? Oh, wake up, Shay. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> hey, sorry, y'all. Back again with another lit fall candle review. <sighs> How y'all doing? Okay, so I don't know. Maybe this might be a bad idea. <laughs> But one of my babies got me a little curious, y'all. So, so I am fresh out of slumber. And oh, let me close this door. This little boy is not this grown ass man. The TV is loud. Um, I'm going to review a candle today that. I'm a little weary about okay it's that infamous candle from goose creek that had me shook called pumpkin sugar churro yeah. <laughs> yeah she was in my comments like you're not going to like this because she had burnt it and yeah so the reason I have brown on is because I'm sure this smells like poo. <laughs> so, <laughs> so okay. I paid twelve ninety nine for this. Um, the notes are I, I don't even want to smell it cold. <laughs> the notes are top creamy pumpkin, brown sugar. Mid is spice churro, apple, and the base is. Warm molten vanilla bean, y'all. That molten word is messing with my psyche. Anywho, <sighs> anywho, it's not much to say about the packaging. You know, Goose Creek is very minimal when it comes to that classic mirror top, regular glass, three wick jar. Um, was it 20? It's not 24 ounce shea. 14.5 or something like that. Uh, and the label is, it looks like, I don't, I don't think I know what a churro is. Oh, okay. I see what it is. Okay. For a minute from far away, it looked like, you know, those, those cookies, crackerish ones, if you will, that have three layers and in between each layer is cream it's like two layers of cream so it's the top cream the middle cracker section then cream then the bottom that's what i thought this was stupid <laughs> okay anywho clearly that's not um what this is this is you don't see any cream okay anywho <laughs> so y'all i'm gonna smell it cold again do I have to? <laughs> Do I? I'm really sitting over here contemplating my life. All right, let me smell. It might smell good this morning, Shay. It might. <sighs> oh, no, I smell it. <laughs> See, one part was okay, but then when I went to this other side, when I went to the left, it went left. Oh no, it's 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 bad right too. Okay, shit. <sighs> okay, the wax is very pretty though. The wax is a tan color. Um and it's not chicken legs, it's medium sized whisk. They're already trimmed. It looks great. So let's not hesitate. <laughs> Let's light and get this puppy started. Stay tuned. <laughs> okay, y'all. So I'm all showered, had some coffee. All right, let's go into this room and see what's going on. I'm so scared. Oh, that's different. That's different. It's definitely different. Oh, yeah. Oh, sour. <laughs> Ugh. It pulled really pretty and it's brown. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> <sighs> okay, hold on, hold on, Shay. Oh, 
Jesus. Ooh, yeah, ooh. Ooh, that's different. Okay. All right, let me start my day and uh, clocking and all that good stuff, and I'll I'll be back. Y'all stay tuned. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. <laughs> oh, okay, y'all. Um, I've been ouch. Um, I've been in this room with this candle, not dying, but um, I think it stuffed up my nose. <laughs> Is that possible? Y'all hear all that? They won't leave me alone. Uh, did I stuff up my nose? <laughs> Stupid. Yeah, um, I will not be buying this again. Period. Okay, got my coffee. So, guys, I just got off of a Zoom call with my um, employer. <laughs> and I was telling him, he was like, turn the camera on. And I was like, no. And he was like, why not? I said, because I look horrible, man. I told him that my eyebrows haven't been done since March 12th. He was like, okay, never mind. Y'all, you can't make this stuff up. Ew, that candle is funky. It's funky. I don't like it. This is going to be a downstairs candle. I might put it in Lonnie's room. <laughs> Whew, I don't like it. Yeah, mm -mm. Okay. You win thumb, you lose thumb. <laughs> Stupid. All right, but the burn is beautiful, y'all. It's a beautiful burning looking candle. Can I say that? Yeah, the colors are really pretty. It's like a tan, caramel, dark, deep chocolate brown. It's really pretty. It's just, it's a tad bit. That sour note. Ah. <sighs> How they put it in there? Why did they put it in there? It would have been so much better. My eyes are watering. <laughs> See, I was in here just sniffing it in. Well, now it's too much. But in any event, I'm going to say the throw is like a eight. <laughs> Isn't that freaking typical? You feel me? Oh my God, this is good. Ooh. Sorry, y'all. Yeah, I'm going to say the throw is like an eight. The flames are medium high. Oh, I love the flames. Yeah, it's just um, an all around good performing looking candle. It It is just stink. <laughs> yeah, she stinks. Oh, bless her heart. Anywho. I'm going to let her burn for about another hour or so because I'm a glutton for punishment. No. And then on to the next. Yeah, she's definitely going to be a downstairs candle. Um, yeah, because, oh, with Goose Creek, you can't say, oh, I didn't like the way it smells. They, they don't care. <laughs> yeah, they don't do that. That's Bath and Body Works. You can actually tell them you're not pleased with something and they will return it. They will refund you. Exchange. Yeah, all of those things. But you know what, though? I'm going by what someone said on the Internet. This um, candle blogger said that um, they have a really strict return policy. But honestly, the two times that I had to call them about something... Um, one, I was asking them when they were going to ship out something and they said, oh, it was out of stock and they refunded me. And then the two broken things, it was basically without incident with the broken ones, though. The young lady was telling me, you know, um, to send her a picture because that was their policy. And of course I had, um, did I not show y'all how, oh, I forgot to show y'all how broken up the, um, fried apple sugar thing was I'm gonna put it in here so y'all can see yeah but I had to send her um the pictures of the two broken um candles and got refunded quick and in a hurry so I had no problems with them as far as customer service is concerned or anything like that I'm not saying that 
he said that there was a problem with customer service, but he was saying that they're just different. You feel me? So why did you go into the whole thing? I don't know. Just talking. Should I do an experiment, y'all? Should I um, send an email and say, hey, love your candles, but this one the sour note really, really was distasteful to my senses. You light up my senses like a night in the forest. I'm stupid. I know you babies like, what kind of song is that? I'm old. Actually, I think I'm going to do it. It can't hurt. I'm just going to, you know, be my professional self and tell them that it smells like ass. I'm stupid. Anywho, having said all of that, having said all of that, I will see you babies later. Love your guts. And y'all be good because somebody.